I thought it was a great script. It presented a world we could readily imagine in the not too distant future, ruined by global warming, collapse of an economy, a government people can no longer trust. But in that, in the core of it all, was this story about a man trying to reconnect with his own humanity himself. One of the first things that sort of drew us to it was the fact that it was really relevant to today's society. This is a story about an anarchy government who basically takes control of society and has no, there's no democracy anymore. Noah Cross is played by Nicolas Cage, and he's an agent of the Humanity Bureau. He's been sent to investigate two members of society who are deemed non-productive. Mrs. Weller, I'm Agent Noah Cross, Humanity Bureau. We have an appointment? Playing Noah for me in the movie The Humanity Bureau is the experience of having a chance to work within science fiction again, which is one of my favorite genres because I think that science fiction is probably the best friend, the best ally, best advocate for freedom of speech. You can make a lot of social commentary. You know, it's in a way encapsulating the fears that so many people have now about the, about the near future. The concept of you know, building a wall or the concept of fear or the concept of people being displaced or there's a lot of dinner table conversation going on with what's happening in the news with global warming, what's happening in the scientific community. And I think that this script speaks to that. Dave Schultz, I think, wrote something that I think is very current and relevant. I hope it'll be a rip-roaring adventure, but uh, a very touching one. There's a real heart to the story, as well as this action movie that's going on.